It's about living my own life. I go to work. I should decide what's important. It's about restoring the American dream. It's about limiting the government to the Constitution. Here in Michigan, the Libertarian Party is about these ideas and much more. The 2016 election cycle was like nothing we'd ever seen. The two older parties just kept calling each other names. Here in Michigan, something special was going on. Lots of people, ordinary people, candidates, patriots, all came together to help Gary Johnson. The Detroit News, the Chicago Tribune, and many others got on board the Johnson train. Serving up notice, there were new ideas in the game. They were acknowledging the ideas and the ideals of liberty that have been growing for a long time. The result of that effort is the Libertarian Party of Michigan is a major party for the first time. In 2018, we have a chance to give Michigan a growing third party, and more importantly, a voice for many who have no voice. It would be easy enough to enjoy the life that I have. I have a successful business, a wonderful family, and I live in the greatest state in our great country. But we have problems. Lansing is broken. Plain and simple, broken. Rick Snyder promised to be above the fray as a fair broker to get the old parties to work together. But after getting elected, he got sucked into business as usual. And we've bobbed back and forth between Democrats and Republicans, all of whom are going to change things. Let's face it, they're not getting your message, folks. I'm ready to take the opportunity that Gary Johnson has given us and build upon it. I may not be Ron Paul, but I will do my best to explain the principles of liberty. This chance can't be missed. The Libertarian Party will only remain a major party if we all work together to make it happen. Not some of us, all of us. Are there libertarian issues? You bet. When I got involved with the medical marijuana campaign in 2008, I began to understand how important it is for citizens who are managing pain, whether it be from cancer treatment or other treatments that they've uh, had to have to, to stabilize their lives that medical marijuana was a solution. Libertarians are ready to meet the challenge of serious ideas and serious public policy. When we talk about things like uh, medical insurance, when we talk about how we're gonna handle the financial aspects of the ends of our lives, this is one of those things where people ought to be the ones making that choice. And we're ready to fight for what we know is right. But the fact that that our National Guard can be used by the federal government to support war means that I as a, as a governor want to do everything I can to prevent the federalization of our National Guard. And isn't it time we get our roads in shape? And how long are we going to allow Flint to fester? It's time that we send a message loud and clear. There's a lot to do, but there's a new voice that's come to the table. My name is Bill Jelano. I'm ready to be the Libertarian candidate for governor of the great state of Michigan. Join me at ComeTogetherMichigan.org. This time, we're going to make a real change.